subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates in 2022 the indian space research organization isro turned 50 the institutions r and d activities over last 5 decades were reasonably secretive if not obscure they were certainly not in the realm of commoners like us to track so space related commercial activities were almost unthinkable but in the last few years things changed and dramatically so most of the changes germinated in the space startups hi i'm tanushree banerji editor of equity masters blue chip recommendation service stock select Welcome to Safe Stocks where we discuss ideas to create and preserve wealth in the safest businesses. If you haven't subscribed to the Equity Master YouTube channel yet, please do so and click on the bell icon to get notifications for my latest videos. So in 2018, when two undergraduate students at Bits Bilani were working on an artificial intelligence project, they had a problem. Their analysis was handicapped by the lack of high resolution satellite imagery data. They soon realized that there's a market for a satellite company to offer high resolution imagery data. This was the start of Pixel Space, a space startup which offers high resolution satellite imagery. With these images, the company seeks to solve various problems in climate change and agriculture. In less than 5 years, Pixel Space is one of the 100 odd space tech startups operating in India. There are two prime catalysts for this. The latest changes in the Indian space policy and the setup of the Indian National Space Promotion Authorization Center. Together, they have allowed Indian private space ventures to take a giant leap. The government is now encouraging the manufacturing of satellites in the private sector for their applications across healthcare, agriculture, urban development and property tax exemption. So, space tech startups like Pixel, Skyroot Aerospace and Agnikul Cosmos are collaborating with ISRO for satellite imagery as well as future space missions. But are the space tech ventures viable? Well, So far the funding and technological collaboration of the space tech startups have been very encouraging. Funding into the sector jumped 198% in 2021. Also over 55 new startups have registered with ISRO and the Department of Science since the opening of the sector to private players in 2020. These are involved in activities across the space tech supply chain. from the so called upstream companies which are making the satellites and even rockets and propulsion systems and new rocket fuels to the downstream ventures which are looking into analyzing of satellite data to provide useful satellite imagery insights the topping on the cake was that american aerospace giant spacex expressed interest to facilitate approvals for the use of satellite technology in india This was meant to further penetrate its satellite-based internet offering in the rural parts of the country through Starlink service. Whether or not SpaceX comes to India, the Indian space tech ecosystem is large enough to attract billions in funding and innovate to make India a commercial space tech hub. Mind you, the ecosystem is brand new and much bigger than that of electric vehicles. Here too I would not bet on the most obvious contenders companies looking to launch commercial satellite vehicles or invest heavily in satellite imagery could carry a high degree of risk on their balance sheets rather a niche company assisting space tech ventures with its technological offerings while itself being quite profitable is a much safer bet The stock of one such company recently made it to my product Equity Master Venture. Few others may follow suit. The success of space tech technologies is bound to have its cascade effect on sectors such as communications, transportation, agriculture and disaster management. Technologies such as satellite broadband which is estimated to generate 50% of the global space market growth by 2040 and mapping ecosystems that thrive on receiving consistent real time information transmitted from the satellite are just a few amongst many that are set to revolutionize human lives further. 
with the pace of investment activities ramping up in the sector, the Indian space tech segment is expected to clock a 48% compounded growth to the tune of $50 billion by 2025. So although at a nascent stage currently, this is a segment all set to take off. I will be keeping a close eye on the most lucrative opportunities in this space. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching.